So how do you feel when uh, you're trying a new restaurant? So excited. I'm so passionate about food and restaurants in Montreal. I can't wait every time I try a new restaurant. Let's go in. Come on. Oh. <laughs> do you like trying new foods? Yeah, me too. But for Nico at Sadis, this Montrealer, he's taken it to a whole different level. He's a well-known foodie posting reviews to his socials. And today we're at Billy Kay's in Montreal, St. Leonard, where he's going to tell us all about that and how he's eaten 50 poutines in one week. We'll take 50 poutines, please. <laughs> <gasps> wow. How did this foodie journey begin? Uh, I was always so passionate about food, going out to eat, and then I started posting on TikTok, and TikTok, the videos went viral. And then I saw, okay, wow, like this is so cool. So then I kept posting and my following just grew. You ate 50 of these in one week. How, why? I wanted to learn more about Poutine. I wanted to travel across Quebec. I was going based off the suggestions that people would tell me in the comments and people brought me to all kinds of great places I would have never found before. I ended up in a, a farm half an hour north of Trois-Rivières and that ended up winning uh, the first place. This is the best poutine I've ever had. With nearly 50,000 followers on TikTok, his poutine journey that took place the week leading up to Quebec Saint-Jean-Baptiste in June 2022 was a viral hit. After eating 50, he shared his top five favorites. So now, ooh, tell us, what is your next big thing? <laughs> I'm actually opening up my very own restaurant. Minos Souvlaki Hero, coming soon in Montreal's Villery, an idea born from, yeah, TikTok. A follower reached out asking if he wanted to make this dream happen together, serving authentic Greek food, but also on the menu, poutine with a twist. I'm excited to have a Greek poutine, so to do a take on the poutine, the traditional Quebecois poutine, but make a Greek style with a Greek sauce, a Greek feta cheese. My mouth is watering just thinking of them. And for a foodie who's tried it all, what is his favorite dish? As a Montrealer, I'm gonna go with poutine. Well then, let's take another bite. Of course. Delicious. If you still need help choosing your next dining venture, you can follow his reviews on TikTok. I do not recommend you try to eat this poutine alone. It's enough to feed a family. I love food because food is culture. I could learn so much and it, I just feel like it brings me closer to, to whoever I'm experiencing that meal with. So let's continue experiencing this meal together. Absolutely. Let's go. In Montreal, Pamela Pagano. City News.